I just remember, Leslie, the most important thing as we go to test our huge robot is that the huge team doesn't find out what we're doing. Yeah, we can't let huge know anything. Exactly. It's so very we, important. To win a Scorpios claw, Scorpios foam finger claw, to cheer us on in the 32. Uh, try to make me laugh. Funniest comment wins. So here's, here's just a huge team. And I, I really like your use of found parts. <laughs> that, that table's kind of a big deal. <laughs> well, guys, enjoy lunch. Thank you. It's kind of a big wheel. <laughs> hey there, Builder Blog. So, uh, I don't know if you saw our previous video or two previous videos ago. We took a lot of damage. In fact, this is, this is the hub. This is the blade from the Ribot fight. Thanks, L Ribot. Lovingly autographed by both the Scorpios and Ribot team. With stickers. With stickers. We're putting this and a bunch of other stuff up on eBay. And every dollar you guys spend on our broken robot part. <laughs> Wait, I'll that's a robot part? This was a robot. <laughs> I can't use it anymore. I are don't you, know if you can see the defect. Are you sure you could just <laughs> fill this area in with foam? And uh, yeah, no, it's unusable. Yeah, it, it's autographed though. It's autographed. It is autographed. I think Scorpios is on one side, Robot's on the other side. Yep. They put up with so much from me. I kept coming back over there with new well, parts for them to sell to sign. Well, Thank that's you, their Robot punishment team. For breaking so many things. I know. Next time, be gentler. <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> that's why we go there. <laughs> but I do want to assure the blog these are going to come with stickers and autograph cards and poker chips and poker chips. And every dollar spent on these is going to fix Scorpios. Because we kind of blew up Scorpios. So, <laughs> what are you guys doing? What a coincidence to find you here in the battery tent. Wow. You know, funny it's not like I'm following you or anything. Funny it's how you, not like you pit next to us or anything. <laughs> it's uh, funny how you run into people these days. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> funny how you just continuously run into people for hours straight these days. <laughs> <laughs> and then you're just like, hey, Zach, I saw you went to the bathroom, so like, I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, I had to delete that. YouTube gave me a warning. <laughs> Just me peeking over the stall. Hi, John! Uh, you got any in there? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cool. Wait, yeah. Put the iron on. Yay! Six more pounds of junk you can put on it. Yep. Also, it's been big pounds, so that'll be a little bit too. This seems bigger than last time. Did you go, did you follow my recommendation get bigger wheels? We did not. I believe the middle is bigger again. It always gets a little wider. Yeah. We always find some way to up our game, which in lieu of getting better generally means just kind of getting wider. We can do one of the other knuckles. You barely fit on the scale. It's, it's as per tradition. That's the video in itself. <laughs> <laughs> And last week's giveaway winner of the extra large Scorpio shirt is going to be GG Falco. Congratulations, you won the shirt. For your recommendation of a series of combustibles, you actually think just like our sponsor, Menzoni Trucking, and they are building me a test arena with a bunker. And uh, they want to see me hit combustibles. So, uh, future video, please like and subscribe. We're going to blow things up. Maybe the robot. <laughs> so this was the configuration we chose for our huge match. We went with our largest diameter weapon blade and the top protect ears to try to keep Huge's weapon away from our belt. So... We're also running very light magnets, so we can still wheelie a tiny bit, but there's not much of a wedge game you have to worry about when you're fighting huge. Right here, we were trying to dial the robot in to make sure there was no way it could flip itself over, even if we take a swing while doing a hard spin. So, we've got everything ready. It's time. It's robot fighting time. It's huge! Can Why? you tell I'm in a bad mood? Yes. Is it showing? Yes. <laughs>
Okay, our next fight is huge. Huge. And we're going to take the whiplash strategy. So out of all the robots in the top 10, when we saw we were the 27th seed, we were like, oh, God, we're going to get someone in the top 10. I was actually hoping for huge. Yay! Because he thinks he's so above it all, but he's not above the arc of the hammer saw. <laughs> so we're one of the few robots that can hit him where it hurts. And uh, I, I'm going to take Whiplash's strategy for beating huge, which is box rush! Box rush, box rush, box rush! And just live underneath the weapon. Because if you just sit underneath the weapon, he can't spin it up. And so we're just going to sit there and then take pot shots with the arm. And uh, if we could do that, if we could do that, we're going to defeat the undefeated robot. Woo! So, wish us luck. Tune in tomorrow on the Discovery Channel to find out if this is a huge upset. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Shiver me timbers, batten down the hatches. It's time. We're going to raid them on the left side. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. No problem.